Well, when we think of Needham, we don't often think of those less fortunate. However, due to the tough economic climate, lack of food and other daily necessities are sometimes hard to come by for people everywhere. That's right, Joe, and thanks to generous donations and organizations of the Needham Council, Community Council, a nonprofit in Needham that helps support people who have undermet needs. Those in need have some place to go for help. I actually had the opportunity um, to join the council as they celebrated their volunteers. When people visit the Community Council, they're often greeted with a slew of volunteers ready to help them. The council took time out to recognize their volunteers at their 81st annual dinner. We have over 185 volunteers that really make um, our organization tick. And um, so every year we want to make sure we honor those volunteers. And this is um, our time to do that. Tonight is really about thanking everybody in the community for all the support throughout the year, updating the community what's going on at the council. There's a lot going on, as I, as I mentioned, and um, just having a nice, a nice evening. Those who attended the event at the Needham Sheridan enjoyed a dinner, silent auction, and the company of friends. And those who were honored shared why they donate their time. I just enjoy it. I enjoy all the people that I work with. You meet the wonderful people that come in, a lot of the same people come in every week. And I feel like the programs of the council are just fantastic. I'm very blessed. I don't have to work. So um, I feel this is my way of giving back. And it makes me appreciate what I have, and it kind of like grounds me. Well, I guess it's nice to be recognized, you know, that you know that you mean something to somebody. Along with honoring volunteers for their works of service in the Needham community, guests also had the opportunity to hear from Keith Lockhart, who will be performing at the tricentennial event this summer, honoring Needham's 300th anniversary. I'm here because, well, heck, it's not every day that a town turns 300 years old. Uh, the Pops has joined in uh, Needham's tricentennial celebration. Uh, we're presenting a concert at Symphony Hall as part of our pop season. Needham Night at Pops, a first, I think, certainly in the first time in my tenure that a community has come together to celebrate itself at the Boston Pops. We're thrilled to be part of it. Uh, we wish everybody a spectacular season, and it's uh, it's a great chance to focus on an important community in our area. For more information about Needham's tricentennial event, you can visit their website at www.needham300.org. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Antonetta Coralia.